right, so this is part two of my first tutorial video and in this one I'm going to show you how to install the compact flash drive actually in your Amiga. I'm also going to tell you where to get the parts from and uh, just a, basically a recap of the parts you can need. So um, let's get on and show you what to do. Okay guys, now we're ready to attach the hard drive. Now I've opened the Amiga up and flipped the keyboard over and as you can see this wire here this is the wire going from the keyboard to the Amiga. Down here we have the kickstart ROMs and I've got 3.1 ROMs installed. And over to the left here we have a 44 pin ID strip and this is where the hard drive is going to be attached. Now if you've already got a hard drive attached then you immediately know that's where you can attach it. But for anyone who doesn't this is what, where we can attach the hard drive. As you can see I've already got mine all prepared. But there's one really important um, issue or thing that you need to remember. You see this red strip, this red thing here? Always have that red strip to the bottom or the left side of your ID to compact flash converter. Now that is really important, otherwise it's not going to work. Now when you go to attach this to the 44 pin strip on your Amiga, always have that red strip to the bottom or the left side of these pins. That is really important because if you don't do that then obviously the um, hard drive is not going to work and it's not going to show up when you go to partition it. So all we do then is attach it up and voila we're ready to go. We're ready to partition well, the hard I drive. I hope you found uh, this first tutorial really helpful. Um, so I'm just going to do a quick recap of the parts you're going to need and where to get them from. Okay, so the first part, obviously you're going to need a compact flash card, but you can get this from anywhere really, so I'm not going to tell you where to get that from. The second and probably most important part is the ID to compact flash adapter. I'll give you another little close-up. Now, you can get this from eBay. Um, again, the sellers are probably probably going to be from Hong Kong or Japan uh, so just check the feedback rating of the sellers and they'll probably take about uh, two weeks to come through but uh, that's where to get the ID to compact flash adapter from so that's eBay. Now the last two parts which is the jumpers and the little ID cable that's a 44 pin to 44 pin ID cable. Now you can get these two parts from um, AmigaKit.com. Now this is your one stop shop for all things Amiga and I seriously recommend that you go and check out the site and bookmark the site because if you want to do anything to the Amiga then chances are you're going to need to go to the site. They sell everything you could possibly want for the Amiga software, hardware, I don't know if you want cables, accelerator cards, um, just anything really, um, SCART cables, um, just anything to do with the Amiga they'll sell. They even sell refurbished and brand new Amigas. They're expensive but you know they still sell them. So go and check out AmigaKit.com and uh, it doesn't matter where you are in the world, they've actually set um, the site up so if you're in America, Canada or Europe then you're sorted um, they, they cater for all those uh, uh, continents so um, that's amigakit.com go and check it out that's where you get these two parts from and um, so yeah I hope you found this first tutorial really helpful and I shall be posting the second one soon guys so thanks for watching